What's good, Gorilla Gang? Just going back with another video, man. Um, so basically, the install I got today, uh, I'm be inserting my grill lights. Um, should be quick and simple. Shouldn't be too hard. Um, but basically, what I'll need is today I'll need the wire taps, or these clips here, um, some 3M tape, and then probably like a blade or something. Um, but yeah, before this video start, make sure you guys go ahead and like, comment, subscribe. Um, join the uh, join the gorilla game, man. Uh, join the movement. Let's get it started. Um, but yeah, let's get this video started. All right, so basically. This is what we're changing out here. So we're taking these grill lights, I mean these um, panels right here off. Now, well, first we just gotta, what I'm gonna do is, we take out these rivets here. All of mine not even. All of mine not up here. It should be like 20 something, or 12. so we can bring the cords up underneath there. So now, we just come underneath here. We should just be able to pop these things out. I got one piece off right there. So it's kind of hard. They glue, they had hot glue my shit on there for some reason. But I'm still working on the other side. So I'm about to pop this one off like the same way. I'm not gonna use these anymore. Um, but now, shit. So now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take these. I'm gonna put this through here. I'm gonna feed, feed the wire up through here. And then Three of them tape, and I'm gonna tape that up on up, up here. You just gotta find a spot up in there. Let me go do that. Real quick.
So these two ends here, you're not gonna need. So these two ends, so you can just cut these off. to this yellow wire here so we need to cut these off too as well so yeah so we're gonna take this piece here we're gonna connect it to the to your headlight cable here. So, show you. so this cable here, and it's gonna be the um, this white and tan wire here. So that white and tan. One. So we're gonna connect it to that. We're gonna splice connect it, and um, that's how we're gonna get it. Started. So. Right, guys so i got the first two clamped up um let me pull it out so you guys can see it real quick. so basically you're gonna have three you're gonna have three black wires you connect those three black wires to any um you can connect that, that that black wire that, that comes with your lights you can connect that black wire to any three black wires that's on this um light that's on your switch here so basically um and then for the red one you connect it to the white and the tan wire um you use the splice so basically it should be good now for that part now you have to drop the other red cord that come with the lights down to your side marker and do the same exact thing um and i'm gonna show you guys um how it looks when i get down there so let me go ahead and get that started for you guys so i actually got the side marker off and basically what you want to do is you want to connect this red wire here um and drop it and this is actually the one from your light so this is not the one from the yellow wire so this is one from your light you actually drop it down um to where you can grab it and bring it down and so it can connect here so um i'm about to get that started and then i'm gonna bring it down so you guys can see what i'm talking about all right so now i brought that um i brought that cord all the way down i made that wire all the way down so now you guys can see let me actually fix this a little bit. There we go. So you guys can actually see what I'm about to do. So like I said, do not connect this to your black wire. Do not connect that to your black wire. So I'm going to take it.
got it plugged in, so I got it plugged in. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just test it out and see how it is, how the first one is. Nope. Figure out what I was actually going to, how I was going to do it. Um, so what I did was, um, I hooked the actual black wire to my ground here. I already have my, my, this is where my grill lights is hooked up to, and this is actually my, for the, um, for the, for the snorkel light. So basically, I did that, and I took the red wire, um, down here, dangle it, and I got it down here, and I got it taped up to, um, my side marker, so it can always come on, my side markers come on. Um, another thing I did was, so I didn't actually, I actually didn't use these blue clips here, um, these was like stopping the connection and was not actually working. So what I did was I just snipped um, like the actual orange and white wire or the tan and white wire for that one. I just snipped it and basically just connected it to the red wire here. So um, it can get the connection like it was supposed to be getting. Um, but here's the results. I'm gonna go turn the car on. So I'm actually going to try to record this side so you guys can see actually what I did um, on the other side. Um, so you can stuff out the way. Alright, so what you want to start with is taking off your um, coder with your air intake. Alright, 
tired guys so we finally finished up so what I end up doing I'm gonna show you guys the light so I didn't show you guys so what I, I grounded it the black wire from the, the light to the um, actually my side fender right there and then I came and attached the yellow wire if you can see it right there to the green and white wire on the back of the um, wire harness right there so once you do that and then I oh and then I got the other red the red one right there so the other red wire is hooked right there and then when you get in start the car those lights should be on and running just like that hazard lights on or your signal lights no matter which one you do um, that's what it looks like after that this is what you guys wanted to see so this is like the finished product of everything here um, so now I'm about to just put everything back together I'm about to just put my um, code area tape back together and um, I'm gonna show you guys the finished product once I put everything back together. That is the final product, and that is how the grill lights look now. It's a lot brighter. A lot brighter and then I also have um, my grill lights to go along with them. so let me turn those on real quick all right and that's what it look like with my grill lights on I had thought I messed something up <laughs> but that's what it looks like with my grill lights on and uh, but yeah I really like it I honestly like it a lot more it has a lot more light to it where I can see better at nighttime too when I'm driving on like back roads and things like that. So that does add a lot of features to things like that. So I really, really like this feature. Um, I was gonna do some like some colorful ones, but I'd rather, I'd rather it be like this, just plain and basic, just to match the headlights. Um, but yeah guys, that's it for this video. Um, if you like it, remember to like, comment, subscribe, leave any comments that you wanna know about how I did it, uh, about where I got the lights from and things like that. Um, so I will put all those that information inside the, uh, the description down below. Um, but if you have any questions about um, how did I put them on, like it's some, some, some stuff I didn't show you guys or something like that, then I mean, feel free to put it in the comments. You can hit me up on Instagram at QC with the charger. Um, I also have that in the description as well. Um, but make sure you guys, yeah, like, comment, subscribe. Um, yeah, be a part of the Gorilla Gang, be a part of the movement, um, but yeah, let's get it, Gorilla Gang out.